if you use macros a lot in windows office then you have to watch this video because microsoft is going to block the office macros by default and this is starting from july 27th the vba macros the visual basic applications macros in the office apps by default they will be blocked starting from this month now they announced this by default block because they want to stop some people from abusing the feature to deliver the malware via the email they stated that vba macros are a common way to for malicious actors to gain access to deploy a malware and ransomware in your system therefore to help improve the security in the office they are going to change the default behavior of the office applications to block the macros in files from the internet and they are going to roll out this feature in access excel powerpoint visio and word on windows and uh, this is not going to affect the office for mac and also the android and ios devices now the main thing here is that this applies to the office files that are downloaded from directly from the internet and they include the macros now here the security is the main thing the hackers have been targeting the office documents with a different type of malware macros for years now by default the macros can be enabled by just clicking a single button but that is really risky and it was really easy for the hackers who use this type of macros to hack in your system but now instead of a simple button that will be a security risk banner now if you want to unblock the macro you can easily do that so don't worry about that macros are the main reason behind the ransomware in most of the systems there are almost 30 percent ransomware incidents happen only because of macros now some security researchers are happy about this but they still think that microsoft took a long time for this simple change now the simple thing here if you want to run the vba macro then you have to just remove the mark that the file is coming from some another computer and you have downloaded from the web you just have to click on the unblock and then apply ok but this one just adds one more extra security layer for you so you think once again before running the macro file what do you guys think about the microsoft office blocking the macros by default uh, please comment down below and yeah guys as always thank you for watching this video see you later